Hi guys, this is Rusty78609 in my luxurious studios in Central Texas, USA. This is Halloween Day, 2017, October the 31st at about, I don't know, around 3 p.m. And what I want to show you is, and this, we're going to talk about RV warranties, okay? And a lot of people are a little bit confused because a lot of people think that the dealership provides some type of warranty. They don't. The only thing they do is they do the service. <clears throat> at the dealership. I have a 2018 Coachman Clipper Cadets 16 CFB and whenever I got my RV and got ready to leave the dealership they handed me this okay and it says Coachman right here right well inside of this little zippered pouch is about a jillion a jillion's an exaggeration of course but a lot of warranties, okay? You want to see them? There they are, guys. All kind of stuff, okay? Now, <clears throat> what those warrant? Of course, you got to register them all and all that kind of stuff. You know, send it in. But there's a, there's one here for the battery-powered smoke alarm. How about that one? Uh, this is for what? I don't know some kind of Legrand something. Uh, this is for the thermostat. They got a warranty for the thermostat. This is the uh, for the GFCI receptacle. And here's the energy guide for the uh, 5000 BTU Danby air conditioner. 11.1 EER estimates $41 a year in annual operating cost, which is nothing. Okay, then here is a list of all of the things, okay? The air conditioner has a warranty, awning, furnace, converter, range, oven, the range, refrigerator, stereo, none, tire, spare tire, tire individual tires, all they all have their the stuff on them. Uh, the axle is a Dexter. 3,315 pound spring axle, water heater, suburban, water pump, the 12 volt pump, SureFlow, toilet, Thetford, Thetford, if you have a lift, you can't say Thetford. Anyway, microwave is Emerson, and then the propane tank is a Manchester 20 pound, okay? And they got all my serial numbers right here, okay? But here's the, here's the little, you got books on every one of them, all right? Book, 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 all right? Then, then, and to add a little flavor, and I'm going to try to be brief here, uh, they also offer this thing called CoachNet, okay? CoachNet is, they'll tell you at the dealership that that gives you 100% coverage, 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, includes towing. It's a freebie. Doesn't cost you anything. Wrong! You know why? Because it isn't free. It's free the first year, okay? The first year. And then after that, in order to maintain that, quote, free coverage, you have to take your RV to the dealership for a $199 inspection where they check everything out. <clears throat> and as long as you do that every year, it's free. Figure that one out. And here's the Travel Trailer Owner's Manual right here, and it doesn't have really anything of interest in there. Uh, well, there's, there's, there's stuff in there. And here's one here on the air sales suburban something thing. Uh, Drop-in cooktop. you got to have that one. And this is uh, the something suburban drop-in cooktop again. And this one says warning, and I don't know what it is, but it's a stick-on thing. This back peels off, and this sticks somewhere. I can stick it somewhere, all right. And then this one is the Danby AC right here. I'm going to leave that one out because I'm going to try to figure out how much power that little booger draws. And then this is the Master Owner's Manual. And this is about towing and all kind of stuff. And this is the Dexter axle stuff. But it says right here, 600 to 8,000 pound capacity. And that's not true. And then it talks about brake controllers and a lot of other stuff, but it never really tells you which one you have. You have to know that because it's on another sheet. And then we get to Pentair. Pentair. Who's Pentair? Pentair is the SureFlow bypass pump, the water pump, 12-volt water pump, okay? 
And then I'm just going through these to show you because when you buy an RV, this is what you buy. These are your warranties right here. The dealership does not much. They, they have a service department. Uh, this is the stuff on the gas water heater. This is the, uh, oh, you can buy extended coverage if you want to on the Suburban products, which I'm not going to do. And uh, this is, I don't know what this is. They got it sealed up and shut up and all kind of stuff. Let's find out what secret is. I've never even looked at this stuff. Okay, this is the... This shows uh, the basic original price that they had on the product. I paid $9,750. The total that they have here is, as you can see, $14,837.25. Okay, that's what they were going to ask for it when they put it on the dealership. Okay, and what would happen is, is somebody would come in there and look at that and they say, my gosh. 14837 and they'd have it on sale for 12995 and you would buy it and you would have paid $3,000 too much. But anyway, the shipping weight is 2,442 pounds, carry capacity 1233, hitch weight 360. The total length of, from the tip of the hitch to the back of the bumper is 18 feet 4 inches, the height's 9 foot 8 inches, fresh water 33. A black water 25, gray water 25, and then a single 20 pound tank. It says 13 an inch aluminum wheels here, but that is incorrect. They are 14 inch. Okay, and what else? Uh, the base unit is $12,216, and the freight was $1,238. 10% of the cost of this product was getting it here. Okay. And, uh, and then they added $145 for Cadet Towable Essentials Package. All right. Anyway, <clears throat> what else? Uh, this is something here. This is some kind of stuff they want to sell me, but I need to keep this out. But anyway, I just wanted to show you. So whenever you go to buy a new RV, guys, uh, just bear in mind that uh, you're buying a whole sack full of warranties that are individual and when you take your RV to the dealership if you have any kind of problem it's going to be covered by one of these warranties okay and what that means is before they do the work before not after or during but before they start work on your RV they're going to contact the manufacturer of that product to be sure that it is covered by warranty and they're going to get paid all right and if it takes a day or two to get that approval then you're just sitting there looking out the window like a little bird all right and uh, so having said that what else is there there's more stuff here you know there's all kind of stuff but anyway it, it, it'll it boggle your mind guys that you're going to be inundated with separate little warranties on every little component all the way through and then when you go to the dealer uh, if the manufacturer of that product if you're outside the warranty if you've had your, your rv for over one year 90 percent of these are useless all right i think a couple of them go for two years maybe the refrigerator i doubt it maybe the air conditioner i'm not sure but having said that that's what this video is all about just giving you a heads up so if you're looking at a new rv whether it's a motorhome a travel trailer a fifth wheel or whatever uh, you're going to get this. It, if you buy a new one, you're going to get all this stuff, okay? And that's all I wanted to say. So just be aware of how the whole thing works because when you walk in there, the salesman's going to say a lot of things, and they're all true. They're all true, kind of, you know what I mean? They just kind of take the truth and stretch the hell out of it. And, uh, you know, the implication is that you've got 100% protection. You may, you may, you may, I doubt it. And it all fits in that little zipper bag, but keep those because, again, after the first year, I don't think there's many things covered. But having said that, from Central Texas, USA, this is Rusty78609. Thumbs up. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye-bye. Buy USA made when you can. Also, caveat, use the Amazon link in the description if you choose to because I'm an Amazon affiliate. If you use the Amazon link and go to Amazon and buy a product of any kind, I get a small commission. Doesn't cost you anything, but we benefit. Okay, the channel benefits. So anyway, use it if you choose to. Okay, now, 
Uh, drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day will not hurt you. What else? Uh, stretch walk. Take deep breaths into your nose and out to your mouth several times a day. Why? Why, why, why? Because it'll keep you healthy. Okay? And breathing in and out through your mouth, in through your nose and out through your mouth several times a day will help lower your blood pressure and that will keep you healthy. So I'm all about keeping you guys healthy because I want to keep healthy. So anyway, enjoy your day. Happy Halloween. Notice my mask. <laughs> it scared you, didn't it? <laughs> Only problem is I can't take it off. So having said that, guys, hey, Google. Tell us a joke. One joke coming up. Parallel lines have so much in common. It's a shame they're never going to meet. You probably couldn't hear it. I had the volume turned way down. But anyway, that's my Google Home device. Thumbs up, guys. Happy Halloween to you, 2017. Bye-bye.